basically what we learned from this study is tick were able to sense infection in the blood mill indirectly targeting the immune molecule in the blood not the bacteria itself so to do that then the question is how they can do that first thing is the detection so you have to detect first to induce a defense response right uh, let's say you you feel heat or you feel cold or somebody touch you those are the signal that you get from the environment and that signal converted into a ligand and the receptor binds to the ligand uh, arthropod have their own ligand but this time ticker repurposing or retooling the receptor to target a vertebrate cytokine. They are able to change the receptor a little bit just to grab or sense a cytokine or a protein from a completely different host. That is a surprising uh, aspect of it. So what it shows that even those simple metazoan pathway can be so flexible in their ability to adapt and target and bind protein from a distant species. What is surprising in this, in this study that this receptor that they are using is a multipurpose protein. It not only direct the defense, it also very important for their own physiology and development. So integrating immunity and development through a central receptor, a central protein is something very interesting and novel. And goes beyond that, it is possible that all the other ectoparasites have a very similar strategy. So we think the implication here is that a similar cross-species signaling might be operative in other infection, other vector, or, or other host parasitic relationship that we never knew before. That parasite can retool their own protein to sense something very distant, something that is they are not meant to, but that is very helpful in their evolution and survival in the nature.